what's going on everybody thanks for tuning into another video uh before we start this video make sure to like comment and subscribe uh drop a comment down below at the end of the video but yeah um i had a little accident in my purple car um nothing too serious but i messed up and this was my fault and i felt really bad but um we're gonna go ahead and get into this video i'm gonna just huge shout out to next level works out in california i'll drop their instagram information down below and on the screen they hooked me up with a brand new piece but before I go ahead and show you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and start this video off with a little cold start. It's a little warm out here, but I haven't turned the vehicle on in a couple weeks, so enjoy that and stay tuned for the video. Car is a little filthy, but let's do a little cold start. guys back to the video so as you guys can see I don't know if you guys notice anything different but the bottom piece of my splitter is gone so it happened a couple weeks ago and it basically it was my fault yeah I went into an entrance that was pretty bad it ripped off the bottom at the corner and it ripped off the bolts right here there's a hole and there's two right there let me grab the rest of the splitter so you guys can see the damage. All right, so this is the piece that broke off. So this basically went down here. And I'll throw a picture up if you guys don't already know how it looked like before, but that's how it went. And it broke off right here. I took the rear bolt out and it took those two out. That's why there's a hole there and two right here. I mean, the car doesn't look bad like that. But I like this splitter a lot better than just that. Because they sell a splitter that looks just like this with no bottom piece. But yeah, this one's a little bit more flimsier too. But like I said, it's held up pretty good. But now we have a new splitter here. And like I said, big shout out to Next Level Works. I'll put their Instagram handle on the screen. They hooked me up with a brand new splitter. They have um, splitters, side skirts, diffusers, wicker bills, spoilers, every, anything you can think of for mostly any vehicle. So make sure to hit them up. Um, yeah, they hooked me up with the splitter. It won't be the same as this. All right, my GoPro died, so I'm gonna be doing this on my phone. So yeah, um, Next Level Works, they're out in California, but they do ship anywhere. Um, they hooked me up with a brand new splitter. It's a new design. Um, something similar to that but it's it's different um the quality of it is a little bit sturdier than the one that i have now it's a little thicker it's the same like plastic ish but it just feels a lot sturdier so it's got these on the side it's got the same fin but it's got those two extra pieces right there and then the middle part it's like a two-piece and then the end because this they don't have the splitters like it's not a one full splitter you can see there's a right there right there where they line up and this one's the same um yeah so we're gonna go ahead and, i'm gonna go ahead and put this together they send you everything you need in here um, i had already went ahead and opened the box just to make sure everything was in there but I think I left the bolts inside, so let me go grab them real quick. I'll be right back. All right, like I was saying, they send you um, the hardware you need to to put this stuff together. Um, there's no instructions, but it's pretty much plain and simple. Uh, we'll take everything out. I'll lay it out, and then I'll show you guys where the um, bolts need to go to. And um, yeah, so let me get this out situated, and I'll show you guys what it looks like. All right, so I kind of put it together already. I haven't put the bolts on, but this is what it looks like. You got those two end pieces right there. Then you got the, what it looks like, you know, air dams, but they're not, they don't go through. Then you got those two other pieces and then the wings on each side. So I think that's gonna look real good compared to the one I had. I'll do some side by shot, side by side shots at the end of the video. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and put this together. Like I said, they send you two different types of bolt sizes. 
And I believe the smallest ones are the ones that go underneath to put this piece together. And then, if I'm not mistaken, the longer ones are the ones you use for placement of the vehicle to drill on your bumper. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use those. I have self-tapping screws that I used for this and I haven't had any issues with it. So I might just use those and just keep these on to the side just in case I need them. But we're gonna put this together um, and then I'll show you guys. I'm gonna remove this one, show you the um, self-tapping screws that I use and then we'll put this one back on and go from there. All right, so you guys can see I flipped this over. This is where your bolts are gonna go bottom and at the bottom of these this piece goes right here it goes over it so you'll have two bolts right there and then one right here that would be the same on this side so we're gonna go ahead and put these bolts in the middle I have my drill be careful though with this with stuff like this you don't want to over tighten it or over torque it because then you'll break the splitter or you'll go through and it'll come out the other side so just be easy with it if you're going to be using the drill. I'm sure you could probably do this by hand, but it's going to take you a little longer. Just take your time, don't rush it, and you should be fine. So I got this piece already put together. So there's one, two, three, four, five, and six. And like I said, you don't want to go over and tighten it too much because then you'll probably puncture through the top. And that's not going to be any good, so yeah. Don't do that, and you should be fine. So if you guys are wondering what screws I use to place the splitter on my bumper, this, these are the screws that I use, self-tapping screws. They work great. Um, haven't had any issues with them, like I said. Splitter stayed intact after even driving. I think it's been over a year. High speeds, low speeds. Um, it's taken a few hits here and there, but this last hit that I did, did it pretty um, it was pretty bad so i guess it was its time but yeah let me go ahead and put this other one on and i'll show you guys how it looks all right guys it's another day um it got dark on me when i was getting this put on last night but i finally got it put on and uh it's easier if you guys have maybe at least another person to help you hold it um i was kind of trying to line it up pretty good as best as I could but it looks good right now um, like I said I used the self tapping screws that I had on my old splitter and um, let me see if I can show you guys what it looks like but if you guys see down there there's one there's two and there's more I think it was a total of five on each fin on the other side and then I think it was like four or five more um, it's pretty on there sturdy and um, yeah I like the way it looks um, definitely needed something different and I like how this one turned out it's, like I said it's got the two little fins right there and the little wing and then this middle section right here my other one didn't look like that but yeah that's pretty much it um, let me know what you guys think they also do offer this splitter and a gloss finish and also a carbon fiber finish but make sure you guys check them out on instagram i'll drop their information down below in the description and right here um next level works on ig um this is them if you want to check them out yeah they offer various different diffusers worker bills um for they also got louvers, I believe, but they have a bunch of different options. So make sure you guys check them out. Next Level Works. Uh, again, huge shout out to them. Um, they're out in California, I believe. Um, they hooked me up with this new splitter. Uh, yeah, and you know, huge shout out to them because they sponsored me and hooked me up with this nice splitter. I went with the satin because I have my diffuser on this vehicle as well, and it's satin, so. I didn't want to go with uh, the carbon fiber or the gloss and then my wheels are satin also car's a little filthy I'm gonna go ahead and clean it up like I said a lot of people um, think these don't hold up as good but they they do they're plastic and you don't need to add rods to it um, you can if you want but I don't 
I'm not a fan of the rods like I mentioned in my older video about the splitter that I had. I like the way this looks and I like the way it sits with the vehicle. It sits on their flush. But that's going to be it for this video. Thanks for tuning in again. And like, comment, subscribe. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, drop a side-by-side -side picture as well of the old one and then this one so you guys can kind of see the differences in both of them. But I'm really feeling this one a lot more than my old one. And but yeah. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.